What the fuck does get your shit together mean? Wow. Wow. Depends upon what shit and, and, and Do you understand? together with like, whom. When you look at it in context, mm-hmm. because the definition of get your shit together means get a job. Wow. <laughs> Used to. That's the, the, you, that, that the, is the yeah that for is the most the, part. Yeah. I mean, of course, that's no, what Big Mama said when she came down into the basement at yeah. at, at ten thirty in the morning, and you still <laughs> right. laying in your drawers. You, get your you shit didn't together. get your shit together. She meant <laughs> right. Get your shit together. So together. even when we try to clown each other for not quote unquote having our shit together, it's from a skewed perspective. It's from a perspective of assimilation. It's from the perspective of get with the program right now the average black person is not going to look at another black person who behaves like steve jobs as somebody who's got his shit together right you'll try to end result steve jobs Mm -hmm. but if you follow steve jobs that motherfucker is not on the clock that's right no see you're participating in the system as a cog, mm-hmm. not yeah. as the purpose right. for the machine. Nigga, right. you yeah, participate the machine. as a cog. <laughs> yeah, you trying to be you a gear trying to be a lever, and in your mind you think yo shit. You think you a lever is together, and that's the shit I've been saying <laughs> the whole right. goddamn time. See, see, let me tell you what inequality allows for white folk. It allows for imagination. It allows for creativity. A fucking white man can sit on his ass because of generational wealth, right? Mm -hmm. The median family and a white family in Los Angeles is worth three hundred thousand. White man can sit on his ass and dream because his granddaddy bought that chair he's sitting in. Do you see what I'm saying? Yeah. The median white family in America worth three hundred grand. One hundred of it is liquid. Right. So you can sit and think, like, what the fuck can I do with this? Whereas the the median black family, like like Antonio Moore said, take the car out. These motherfuckers just, just ain't shit. Just, so you don't have the time. Then you look at the research from my, my the, the professor over here at UCLA, Benjamin Carney. He says one of the reasons why marriage works, right, for wealthy people, and he says works better, doesn't mean they don't have high divorce rates either just means they last a little longer is because of one thing they got money which translates to leisure time That's right. these motherfuckers can go somewhere in another part of the world and, and think about, think about shit right <laughs> this came to me in the south of France right you don't have listen this came to me on a bus stop in Watts it's different it's different yeah you see what I'm saying so I'm trying to have this discussion I'm saying Niggas is beating niggas up for being what niggas are. And that's broke in America. And the only way niggas can come together and and, and form some type of garrison. You like that word? Yes, I do. The garrison of niggas. The garrison of niggas. Muster the bro harem. (laughs) Right? The only way to do that is to come together in some Form, some shape or form. Yes. But come from where? 